Look at all those snow geese. That's a lot of snow geese. At least for here. Holy cow. Much. And they are going somewhere, but not here. Okay, well, the other hunter left. I guess he gave up. Really, nothing's been coming in here. They fly by, but they don't even don't even react to decoys. He didn't react to his spread or mine, so he left. So now I'm back to having the field to myself, which is actually how I wanted it. But I was hoping, you know, at least he'd get something before he left. So now it's a waiting game. I don't know if I have to wait till the end of the day or. If Things will happen sooner. Who knows? We'll see. I can't believe they didn't see me standing there. Unbelievable. This is a surprise. One. I can't believe they didn't see me standing there. Unbelievable. Oh, yeah. That's okay. That's a nice bird. That big one. That's kind of bloody. That's a big one. Nice. Oh, I missed the other two shots. They're <laughs> really close. 
It's okay now. Got one. Malia can see me standing there. <laughs> All right, dude. Get to your head. Oops. He's out trying to shit the star hat. Scored one with the triple barrel, which was my intention, and that was with the improved cylinder choke. I believe it's improved cylinder or skeet. I think it's improved cylinder. Anyway, I was standing there looking across the field to see if any of them had landed on the other side, and I didn't see anything. I looked up, and there they were. And they, I couldn't believe they didn't see me standing here. I got down and I, I thought they would have seen me and would have veered off, but no, they were going to land. They made their round, come right over and pow, knocked it down with them um, using the state, no, federal, federal speed shock steel, three shock. And I figured I could use small shot at this range, I knew it would be pretty close. Uh, second and third shot I missed, apparently. Too bad, because I could have scored three geese. But, we'll see if anything else comes out. Still got a little bit of time left. Okay, so how I've got it is I've got <clears throat> improved cylinder and kick high flyer modified, which is actually improved cylinder, but it's probably a better improved cylinder than the one that came with the gun and then after that modified simple arrangement uh, shot wise I'm using the first shell three shot because it should be pretty close if they come around like that again um, the second shell one shot and the third one triple B because by then they'll be out there a little ways you know, I don't. I mean, I have some black cloud three and a half inch triple B, but I don't think it's really necessary for this short range. Anyway, uh, that was pretty exciting. I hope to get some more action. <clears throat> well, turned out to be not a total loss after all. We got one giant Canada. I weighed it like uh, 13 and a quarter pounds. Yeah, it's a big one, no doubt. Feet are, I got large hands and the feet are almost as big as my hands. Anyway, I got it with uh, the gun I called Charlie or Charles, the Charles Daily Triple Barrel. And I didn't get the other two because I think I shot over the top of them. It's still a common error that I'm trying to fight because with my hearing protection I wear, I can't get my cheek all the way on the gun so the gun hits high. I know that, but in the heat of the moment, it's easy to forget that and just point at the goose. And I have to shoot below them to hit them. But uh, I got that one anyway, so... I, I just couldn't hardly believe they didn't see me, you know. It just shows how focused they were on the geese. Or on the decoys, I mean. A similar spread to what I used the other day. I don't know how well you can see in this low light. And one large, larger group of geese over there. And then a smaller one over here. With a hole land right here and 
that's where they were going to land too so it worked precisely how I planned it I only had one group uh, buzz the decoys though all day and it was near the end of the day so I'm thinking this field might be getting played out so it, it may not yield anymore the other goose hunter that was here he was on the other side of the field this morning and he he quit he left uh, earlier in the day because of, because of no action so but um, I'm happy to get the one goose and it's huge <laughs> thanks for watching and please subscribe <laughs>